So within the butterfly, you see it's a twin unit, two comfy beds, furnished with soft furnishings, showing a couple of pictures there with butterflies on, one there, and then we have the Stonehenge one because obviously we're just around the corner from Stonehenge World Heritage Site, and again it's got some butterflies on it. Got some nice plump pillows, really nice soft cushion and as you make your way down the bed there there's a throw as well for those chilly nights towel and you get the complimentary packet of biscuits each two bedside tables and you also get our standard welcome pack and i'll give you a quick browse of the welcome pack so a bit about the the butterfly unit then you have your t's and c's there's a bit about the stonehenge We've had uh, a bit of fun with the Stonehenge times that we've created. Um, gives you about all our awards that we've won and the Summer Solstice Festival that takes place. Then there's a few things to do, sheets, uh, giving you an idea. Uh, the fact that you can also book a longer stay should you want to stay longer. Uh, details about on-site shop and stuff like that. You'll find that inside the pod, uh, ready for you when you arrive. Nice quaint little table lights. So you have a seating area down here just for a while I'm afraid. Uh, but um, we've had a revamp in this unit and we've removed the seat from over the other side there where it used to be. Now that gives you place to put your luggage because it was a bit um, tight. Lovely fire burning away there to keep the pod nice and warm and it works really really well. Also, there is the bistro set outside, which is what we will use, as you'll see in a moment, indoors for having breakfast. And you have these lovely patio doors that open it up, and in the summer months, you can just lay in bed and watch the sunset, should you wish to. As I say, there's a bistro set, there's a pile of chairs there, so you can bring one of those chairs into the pod and plop it in the corner there and two of you can quite easily sit at the bistro table inside uh, on a damp day like it is out there today so on the kitchen area you'll see there is a small little fridge underneath with a nice pack box on it uh, the plates and the crockery there underneath for you along with two cups you have your tea coffee and sugar a couple of glasses uh, one of them obviously I've just used for breakfast which you'll see in a minute uh, so that's gone to be cleaned and um, disinfected as with all the pods at the moment during the pandemic everything has to be sterilized after customers have vacated a box of tissues on the side and some hand sanitizer as well and then there's a dustbin as well which has a liner in it um, so that you can uh, remove any rubbish uh, we ask all our guests to remove their litter on departure and return all the crockery to the unit um, so that it's all done and dusted. Uh, you have outside decking lights on the little porch uh, that runs out into the it's like a little courtyard out there. Um, there you can see in the far corner is the fire pit which also doubles up as a barbecue. And again, inside the unit, you will see there hanging up is just in this little packet here, is the tool set for the barbecue. So you can sit out there. Um, firewood and charcoal are available on site, um, and you can purchase that directly through us. Or if you would prefer, you can bring your own. It's entirely your choice. As you can see behind, you have your standard kitchen area all set up. <clears throat> There's a kettle for making your hot drink. Tea and coffee is replenished within your breakfast. You can add that onto your sheet each morning. So again, choices. So I like the fact that we serve all the um, cereal in individual little jars. And you just obviously, you know, just empty out as normal. The milk comes in its own lovely little milk bottle. <clears throat> Quite quirky, different, and again, just stop a top and out it comes to pour. 
Again with the fruit juice, your fruit juice is decanted into its own little bottle as well. There is choices on the fruit juice. You can have orange, you can have apple, and you can have cranberry. So whatever takes your fancy. Again, you can change that every morning as well. well cereal was really nice this morning. I adopted for the special K. Um, there is a selection. You can have Special K, Corn Flakes, um, there's Rice Krispies, there's Muesli. So there's quite a good variety. Also on the breakfast sheet you'll find there's a gluten-free option and um, they, we even um, accommodate vegans uh, and we'll tailor the men breakfast menu as much as we possibly can for each person. So the freshly baked croissant comes in its own little container. Um, comes with preserve as well um, so um, if you want the preserve you can have the preserve um, and you can see that these are freshly baked and really really nice so contained in the breakfast tray is also uh, a fruit yogurt as well as a fruit pot um, these I'm not going to have at the moment I'll put them away for later because in the pod uh, in the butterfly there is a small uh, fridge so I can keep them for later and have them later on if I get peckish which is another good thing about the fact that there is a, a fridge available all in all I find it quite a good breakfast especially where it could be tailored um, to meet any dietary requirements that you may have that in the um, soft furnishings um, that um, basically contrast to the butterfly name that it is uh, you'll see that uh, there's some nice butterflies hanging up there as well uh, it makes it a bit more homely nice door curtain across the doorway there that will pull across and block out just like that um, quite a dark curtain as well so if you're wanting a lion in the morning you're more than welcome to do so check out time now this year will be 11 a.m. Um, so you, there's no hurry in the mornings to get up and check out 